my name is David Braun. I'm a medical oncologist here at Dana-Farber in the Genital Urinary Oncology Division. And I really focus on patients with kidney cancer. A big por portion of my life is really dedicated to researching kidney cancer, understanding why the disease occurs, how we can detect it early, and ultimately how we can have new types of treatments that are available to our patients. Those really cutting edge treatments are really not available at a lot of places. And Dana-Farber really specializes in this sort of innovative cutting edge research. So there's a number of challenges that really are unique to kidney cancer that maybe is different from other tumor types. We know that the conventional types of chemotherapy really don't work for kidney cancer. And so we really have to think of other types of treatments. Fortunately for our patients, these have really developed at an astronomical pace over the, the last few years and will continue to develop in the coming years as well. We use largely uh, anti-angiogenic therapies, medicines that block new blood vessel formation, starving kidney cancer of nutrients it needs to grow, and also immunotherapies, things that really harness the body's own immune system to attack and fight cancer cells. There's certain principles I really try to follow as I, as I work with patients on, on this very difficult journey with often with advanced cancer. One of those principles is honesty. I'm always upfront through good news and bad news. I always want to make sure that I'm honest. But at the same time, I, I want to make sure I'm optimistic and hopeful. For many years, kidney cancer was regarded as an incredibly aggressive and difficult to treat tumor. And we've seen in recent years a big transformation. With immune-based therapies, we're seeing some patients really having this incredibly long survival. While we know that's not possible, we know it's also not enough for our patients. We need to take that from some to most to nearly all patients. And that's, that's what really gives me hope in the future. Everyone either has a direct experience, a family experience, or a friend experience with cancer. And I think to be able to be there in those most difficult moments is something that I think is incredibly special and a privilege. And that's really what drives me every day and, and motivates me to, to have those interactions, but also know we have to do better and to, to really try to do better for our patients. Thank you.